This is an open world post-apocalyptic game where the land is dying. Aloy is the only one that can stop it being she was created by the machines that are now overtaking the planet. You'll encounter vicious storms, unstoppable blight, powerful machines. Aloy has to stop them all. She is the only one. Welcome to Horizon Forbidden West. Thank you for joining me. Let's get started. I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, I'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AI you designed to control the system. But every time I think I have a lead, it comes to nothing. And every night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. And for a moment, I feel whole. But it never lasts. <laughs> I'm always left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So! What are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. 
delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight? Both, actually, but, um... I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. You're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Okay. But, if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Shall we? Got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. What's up, guys? Thanks for joining These me. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. I've been waiting a long there. time to play this Those game. Those plants by the stream should do the trick. Hopefully it's running good. So the Horizon series is one of my favorite games. This is originally a PlayStation exclusive. And it took them quite a while. I, I think a couple of years before it was available for PC. I think it was released, I don't know, maybe a month ago or two months ago. But I finally got it, and it seems to be running decent. Even with the settings on medium, it looks pretty freaking good. Anyway, thanks for joining me. You guys are awesome. Thank you for all the support. I really hope you guys like this series. Let's um, see what else we need to do. Tap Q once to heal. Ugh. Bitter? Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. Collect all this stuff. This is what heals us. Now, the controls are way different than the first game. So I'm going to have to get used to that. I just touched was slimy. I'll take your word for it. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. Yeah, the water's gonna be janky because I have that turned pretty much all the way down just to get this thing to run proper. They did do an update for optimization, but I'm pretty sure they need to do more. I don't know who put these ropes here, but we can use the line to slide down. Find anything good? A few supplies. Here we go. What are we after exactly? Oh, well, that's I thought that the was the backup. Loot. Well, um, it's an AI. It's um, it's hard to explain. Think of it like a set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. Noticed you're uh, traveling light these days. 
Yeah, I, um, ran into some trouble on the way here. Lost a lot of my gear. I'm just taking in the views. They look pretty freaking amazing, except for the water, it looks like. Salvaging shit. machine carcasses as usual. I guess and we could, we could try. We can try turning it up and see what happens, but I don't think it's gonna do us any good. I turn the clouds. I would love to turn them off, but it's not an option. So let's see what this does. How bad it's gonna make everything run. There they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. It's still going to do the same thing. I'd rather just not have that. Uh, where was that? Water. We're just going to go low. See, you can see everything's on medium. Some of it's on high, but most of it's medium. It's about the only way I can run this game, and even still, it's a bit on the laggy side. One day, I will upgrade my PC. I just don't have two grand to put on a GPU right now. But I think... As of right now, of it's running machine. decent. Better take a closer look. Take these. We can make arrows with the sticks. That's more health. And there is swimming in the game. It functions pretty good. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. Good thing we already picked up some Ridgewood. All right. Um, now to craft some arrows. Hold F. Okay. Hold right click, and it crafts Done. arrows. Me too. Arrows ready. Nice. <laughs> Are you just going to be in my, my way? The There's whole a ladder. Time? But can't reach it from here. Yeah, we can. The outpost arrow can't knock free. After you. Just have to target the lock. Uh, they talk a lot too, so I'll be talking and then they interrupt. So, that's a thing. By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission... The, uh, message I found didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. So, um, what happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. Not sure what those plants are for. We'll eventually find out. Some more sticks. Make sure we have plenty of ammo. I think we're maxed right now. Okay, now we're maxed. Now we're good. Down this way. Get to the grass. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. 
Give it a second. Okay, see how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. It's I. It's a weak spot. Right. Okay, so this is definitely different than the first game. Much more information. Oh, no, don't you dare do that. Okay, so turn that off. I'm ready. Basically, just shoot it in the face. Okay, concentrate. Just like that. Is there going to be another, another? one's yep, coming. There's another one. We'll just shoot that one in the face, too. They're basically evil otters, aren't they? How does the focus know all that? It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. We take these arrows? So nope. after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. Hunting Got it. Was to work rebuilding the city. And I set out to find you. Come on, man, hurry up. The one thing I dislike about this game is the audio. Um, no matter what I do, doesn't matter. You can change the settings all day long. The further away they are, even though they're talking, eventually you can't hear them at all. So they have to be like. You right said up. you've had a focus since you were a child, right? Yeah, found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. It's good to have extras. As I was saying, they have to be right up in your face in order for them to be really audible. While moving, tap. Yeah, that's yeah, that's what I've been doing. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them? Please hold for identiscan. Access denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you. Dr. Sobek. Okay. Yeah, nobody's I guess coming. They weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Well, let's find a way in. I should be able to pry this open. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left us here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Now we're, we are going to do some more live streaming. Uh, no Man's Sky. Ugh, what's that stench? It'll probably Entire be once a week. Camp. I doubt. They must have come here to Dell for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And then through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. The rubble? Oh. So this is how you find, like, secrets and information. I'm not sure what he's doing, what he's looking at. Oh, that's where we go. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. Oh, shit. You double tap forward. Actually, any button. WASD. You dodge. That 
some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And the gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Oh, there's one of them right there. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. Rucksack. Part of a machine. Could help fix the gears. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. All right, we get to make a tool. Let's see. Spacebar to craft. Craft complete. Pull caster. Special gear obtained. What else can we make? Anything? Workbench? Nope. Not yet. There. Uh... Pole caster. Now to test it on the debris. I was wondering. Here we go. Pole caster is a versatile tool that allows you to manipulate objects in the environment that have a graded pattern. So what do we do? Hold right. Right mouse. Tap E. Oh, we got to hold. Okay. And then pull. Uh, this one. Whoa! That worked better than I thought. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Huh. What's this thing for? Oh, I might be able to get up there. The grapple point. I don't think I can reach that ladder from here. Well, that door looks promising. But how do I get up there? What's this? Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Okay. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Thanks for the information. Guess we'll find out. Jump and tap spacebar. Right? Jump, tap spacebar. Oh, that's wow. convenient. That works. That pull caster is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry. I'll find you another way up. All right. Looks like we're jumping. Scaling the wall. All right, where was that rope at? Oh, we're jumping again. Big gap. Whoa. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. Um, I want that. How do I get there? There you go, Burl. Thanks.
can't reach it. Oh well. sapiens us we have always pushed the boundary as explorers pioneers trailblazers and now far zenith is taking the next leap into the future that's why we're proud to have resurrected the odyssey when our governments abandoned in orbit far zenith will actualize in less than a decade but that's only the beginning when the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. The Sirius system. There, we'll create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it. But when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is... Data corrupt. <laughs> Playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Well, that's not good. You wouldn't want to be on a ship that blows up. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe. Escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how. Yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Hold on, I want to take a look. Looks freaking amazing. Doesn't look like we can get across the river here. We'll find a way. Let's keep going. Okay. I still can't believe the old ones could fly. They were capable of a lot of things. For good and bad. Sure seems like it. I wonder what it's like up there. No. 
from the stars. The hell? Get up there, Aloy. Come on. My focus might be able to help here. Show off. I hope you guys are okay with story-driven game. This is just the intro. There's going to be less cinematic stuff and things as we progress. But the first hour is going to be very, um, cinematic. Deeper into the creepy ruin we go. <coughs> Holy Above shit. Us. What is that thing? I don't know. It might have been what killed those Osram. Keep your guard up. Pretty oh, sure. Oh, my guard is up. Pretty sure it's not friendly. <coughs> Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. Definitely. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Don't screw this up, Varl. Moving up. I need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. Well, we don't really need to worry too much about that, but in position. Ready when you are. Oh wait, I gotta do this. Okay. And then highlight its, its path. path. I gotta get closer and stay out of sight. I can throw a rock to distract it. Get it into a position where I can sneak up and strike. Just have to wait for the right moment. Time to uh, throw. How do I switch? Rock. Uh, hold to throw a rock. Nope, that's not throwing a rock. <laughs> I'm still figuring this shit out. Hold on. Nope, not throwing a rock. Well, how do I equip? Oh shit. Oh, it knows. Is it highlighting for me? It just knows I'm here. Like I said, I gotta get used to the keys again. Don't you do it. How am I supposed to choose the rock? That's what I want to know. Uh, I don't remember. It's not E. R? No. Oh, it is R. Oh, it didn't work. Gotta try again. Spear strike. All right, R. R is the magic key. At least to throw a rock. Gotcha. Arl, did you do it? Mine's down too. Okay, good. Grab some more sticks while we're here. Now we're going. Oh, look, there's stuff and things up there. Can I get up this? Barrel can. Oh, so can I. Alright, we're good. More of those machines ahead. Nothing you and I can't handle. Let's see if I can get behind him. R. Throw a rock. Wasn't there another one over there? 
on your lead. Right in the neck. Now let's take its stuff first. And we'll get down here, hopefully not get seen. Where'd it go? Oh, it's right there. I could have sworn there was another one. Okay, that one's down. Where the hell is that other one? Oh, shit, it's right there. Come over here, you creepy little bastard. And now you're gonna die. Oh! I waited too long. Got them all. All right. Well, success. Even if it was, I've been meaning botched. to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry, my whiskers offend you. What Anointed. I, why can't I click on this little guy? Looks like this little guy got caught up in the blight. An escape. I oh, hope Fox. it didn't suffer long. The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. Machines must have broken through. I'll There's just loads later. of materials around here. Guess that Osram didn't have a chance to use What's it. What's the inventory look like? Eh, it's pretty much the same as the first one. Health potion. Bunch of this stuff. A lot of it's stuff you can use. Upgrades. Special gear. And this just talks about what you've encountered. And then all the stuff that we've already seen in the cinematics, so you could replay it. It's super dark, and I don't think this game has flashlights. Careful. Traps ahead. Oh, oh shit. Might be able to disarm them. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. And not blow yourself it. up. And got more supplies. What do we got in here? Like more supplies. Camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. I can use this. Okay. I should have what I need to craft a trap. Good lord, look at all this stuff in here. Supposed to go that way, but there's more stuff. All right, these episodes are probably going to be roughly an hour long, maybe a little less, maybe a little more. I don't know. Depends on how carried away I get. What are we doing? Are we? Oh, we're going up. Oh, that's... Don't think they spotted us. That's very different. I better scan them. I've seen this machine before. A scrounger. That's new to me. Let's see where its weak points are. Maybe we should craft some traps. It could oh. help us get by. Shit. Oh, no. 
I just gave my position away. Is there more than one? Yeah, there's two. I don't really want to use the traps, so... We're going to throw a rock. What the hell? Yeah, no, what? What is this? Empty slot. Oh. That's new. Um, R change. I don't want to change it. I just want to use the damn rock. Oh, shit. I only have two slots. Let's go back to the rock. How do I do that? Um... Change. We want equip rock. Come back over here, man. I don't want to craft the damn explosive. Silent strike. And go back to hiding, because there's another one. At least I think there's only one more. I don't see another one. Oh, no! We're clear. Let's keep going, then. Well, I botched that, didn't I? It's fine. Everything's fine. You've been in a lot of old world ruins. Are they all like this? Well, they all have their secrets, but every place is different. Some more supplies. Probably should craft arrows. Well, we were doing pretty good to begin with. How's our health? Our health is full. Don't have to worry about that. Now we go... Up, I think? Yeah. That machine we saw earlier must be on the move. Let's hope it doesn't come this way. Yeah, we don't want that thing over here. The hell? How am I? Oh. Damn, Aloy. She got some legs and arms on her. If I tried that jump, there, I wouldn't make it. No way. Assuming I can even hold on to the bar with my own weight. That's a big storm picking up out there. Yeah. And they're getting stronger. And more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah. But I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We'll need to cut through that big building on the right out there. You use your uh, scanner to search for things. Sometimes there's little secret messages and artifacts, stuff like that. What's in here? <laughs> Aloy, come check this out. Oh, I'm trying. I keep hitting the... What is this thing? Oh, it's that's one of the things. Data. Hmm. This data mentions the tech that... And then you can read it if you want. But you know me, I'm not going to read it. If you want to read it, pause it. Did you pause it yet? Read it yet? Alright, we're good. Zenith traded with Zero Dawn. But it doesn't explain how they got it back up. I'll keep an eye out for more data. Let's see. Huh. A lot of glyphs. 
I'll tuck this away to study later. Looks like we've got to climb up. Um, yeah, we go up right here, I think. Let's push this down just in case we fall, we can get back up. This place is oh, really geez. falling apart. Kind of startled well, me a little. Well, it is a thousand years old. <laughs> Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on the other side's locked. There's another one of those glowing things by the table. Where? What are you talking about? Glowy things. Maybe that thing at the table does something. Are you talking about this? Probably. On to. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase One, establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn, status complete. Phase Two, the asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Brawl. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made by a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's. More than that, it's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this? Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Varl. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, the report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Uh, vi or vile. Varl is kind of sort of freaking out, but I mean, wouldn't you? Huh. Look at that. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. A weapon. Thanks, Varl. We should keep moving. After you. Uh, I'm trying. 
Blast slings launch bombs that affect large areas. This weapon fires frost bombs. Use them against enemies to build up to the brittle state. While in the brittle state, enemies are more vulnerable to impact damage. Good to know. More or less the same thing as in the Frozen Wilds. Horizon. The Frozen... Horizon, the Frozen Wilds. Question is, how do I... Use them? Down here. Is there anything in here? Should we worry about loot? It doesn't look like it. Uh, what the hell? Oh, man. And then what? Can I just jump? He's doing it right. I think we're almost back outside. Good. Look, that must be the machine. It's heading in the same direction we're going. Great. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. Another one of those machines. I could try the new weapon on it. All right, hold F. Okay, I get it. I can do more damage to it while it's brittle. It's already gotcha. brittle, Aloy. Okay, that worked out more quite well. There's got to be more than one, right? And a lot of acid. That big machine must have attacked as they tried to escape. They didn't stand a chance. That was a pretty easy kill. Fire looks a little janky, so, doesn't it? You said this backup is the last hope. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months, there were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow purged them all. Was he part of Far Zenith too? No. He was worse. Looks like we can cross over here. And uh, what other baddies around here? There's got to be more. Any secrets? Doesn't look like there's any secrets, at least not in this area. I kind of want to go up. Oh, not that way, Aloy. Come on now. Go up. There we go. Secrets up here. No, just like it's like multiple ways to go. Actually, we had to go up anyway. Okay, what's gonna jump out at us? Wow. That big metal thing looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium. Imagine going up to the stars in that. Ancient valuables box. That'd be cool to find. What? 
What? Oh. More Osram. Machines tore right through them. These guys couldn't catch a break. Machines patrolling ahead. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them. How do I target? Okay, there's that one. That one. Which might actually see us. So it's only the... Uh, these red areas. This red patch of... Whatever you want to call this stuff. Reeds or something. Oh shit. Now the other one's gonna come. Why is- oh shit, there is another one. One of them over here, at least. We can get this one closer. No. That worked. But it's not exactly close. Do you think it's the only one left, though? No, I could just shoot it in the face, right? There. Problem solved. Okay. Now how to get out of here. Well, lucky for you, Aloy. I turned on all markers, so we know how to get out of here. What is this? Secrets? What's in here? Oh, that's the ancient valuable box. Ancient ring. You can sell for credits. Machine ripped right through the wall. There's a ladder in the back. another ancient supply box. Are they all called ancient supply box? Probably. So tell me something. Sona was really okay with you not going back to the Sacred Lands? As the Nora War Chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Borrow, get the fuck out of my pleased? way, Borrow. I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither. God damn it. Borrow. Move your ass. What am I doing here? We can go up? Oh no, we go this way. What are you? Nothing.
three of those things. And if they slaughtered all those Osirum, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. They're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement, convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? I'll figure it out. Just wait here. <laughs> Aloy! Trust me. And there she goes. Just need to get over to the shuttle to figure out how to make it fall into the basin. Wow, that looks pretty... Oh my god. Is there two of them? Three of them. There's three of those damn things. Um, that sounds fun. Bunch of stuff down there. This game looks amazing. Even with the clouds on low, it looks good. Alright guys, we're going to end the episode here. Tons more to do in this game. Just a massive, massive amount. I want to thank you for joining me. Thank you for all the support. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you want to see more, there's going to be much more of this game. This is Wobble Pop Gaming. I will see you in the next one.